So is this the moment we've all been waiting for? When a higher capacity, longer lasting, faster charging, safer, tougher, cheaper battery comes along to solve the world's problems. Scientists at Stanford University say they've made a battery breakthrough, a high performance aluminum battery. But don't drop the balloons just yet. What's different about the aluminum ion battery? Most current batteries fall into one of two categories. Alkaline batteries made from zinc have powered electronic devices for decades. Lithium ion batteries introduced in the early 90s added the oomph of an energy density that has made possible today's cell phones and electric cars. And now comes a possible third category, the new experimental aluminum ion battery made of aluminum and graphite in a liquid pouch. It offers its inventors some potentially huge advantages. It charges quickly. Stanford researchers got charging time down to a minute. It bends. It doesn't seem to lose capacity even after repeated charges. And they say it's far less likely to burst into flames than lithium ion batteries. It's definitely a high safety battery we have. And it has a reasonable capacity and a very long cycle life. Why has no one made an aluminum ion battery before? They've tried, but most prototypes prototypes have died after several recharges. The new battery was able to maintain its capacity for more than 7,000 recharges, many more than current lithium ion batteries. What hurdles remain? The Stanford scientists say there's lots of basic research still to be done. Tesla's Elon Musk tweeted today, battery breakthroughs need to state power and energy density. We've asked the scientists and they admit that the energy density of their battery, that's the amount of power that can be held within a given amount of battery space is lower than lithium ion batteries, making it less ideal for cars, but perhaps a future way to store energy from the electrical grid. And as anyone in the battery invention biz will tell you, getting from the lab to the mass produced fuel cell is extremely difficult. That's the short answer.